Time is now to head on in Pokemon Light Platinum to our next destination. Hey Johnny, you're the pride of my life. Hope you're always was close to your mum. Head outside and let's go and we're supposed to be running into Ash Ketchum here. Ash is over there. He's the uh, Pokemon World Champion. So let's go and talk to him. Hi Johnny, I knew you'd win the Zeri and Lauren Leagues. I have a reward for you. It's a World Pass. With this pass, you can go to the World Championship, an event that occurs once a year and has all the best trainers. I hope to see you there, but I have to go. Charizard, you fly. And with that, guys, we can go to the Pokemon World Championship. We can go and board a boat. We'll get Honchkray to take us there. I think it's a Drake Breath. No, it's um, it's the water-based one. I can't remember where it was. Um, Seanport, I think. We can get a boat to the World Tournament. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna train up a bit, guys, because I, I want to get everyone to level 80. Before I go to the World Championship, everyone has to be at level 80. So I'll be back in a bit. I'm gonna do some training. Well, that was confusing. But. You've got to go by train from Central City. Yeah, I know. I, for I forgot that Central City had a train station all that time ago. Do you want to take the train to the World Championship? Get it ready. We're boarding now. Trains, 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 trains. If anybody, if anybody was watching our Final Fantasy VIII Let's Play, you'll get that joke. Trains, 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 trains. But we're in the Pokemon World Championship. Which, of course, means we're in the World Championship Village. I want to enter the championship. Let's go and do it. But I did some leveling. Pikachu's now at level 91. And everyone else at level 80. Yeah, the wild Pokemon still ain't getting any stronger, but... That's what trainers exist for! Here's the World Championship area. There's lots of trainers around here. Let's go in the building. Yeah, I've been both Pokemon League, so... How do I enter then? Here we are. You. Do you want to participate? Oh, baby, I do. Step into the tournament room. Welcome to the World Championship! This is the first round of the tournament. Anyone who loses the battle will be eliminated, but the winner will go on to the next round. The first battle is Johnny versus Mina. Let the battle begin! And Pokemon trainer Mina has Pokemon level 60. I think we are going to hand her ass to her in a small paper bag. But don't worry guys, they get stronger, believe me. So at the moment her Pokemon are at level 60, so they're not going to be much of a much of a problem for Coldix. However, as they get stronger, so Coldix must I think I'm going to do this the same as I do in Elite Four. I think I'm going to put the Pokemon, the Pokemon World Tournament on it all in one day. It's got a level 60 Pidgeot. Cold it fell. Electro, you're up.
As soon as Electro gets to the level that I know he's definitely not getting Volt Tackle, I'm evolving that bastard, by the way. But we beat Myrna. That was a good battle. The winner is Johnny. Let's advance to the next round. Now we're fighting Catchy in the second round. And she's got six, she's got Pokemon at level 65. So we've got to so we've got to do it like in the Elite Four. Straight up, we've got to continue with no healing items. Great. Um So we're just gonna do this in one video then, I suppose. Fuck Electro's down! No! Draconist, go! They keep using Outrage, that shit works. Go on. Draconis, go back into Outrage. No, Draconis, don't do that. Fuck. Come on, Draconis, fight. Torkoal. Could really do with a chance to heal up after this battle, you know. I'm going to take this turn now and do it. Get Electro back in the fight. At least get them so they're not dead, so they can they can step up if needed to. Draconis is down. Jaw, step forward and take him out. Dragon Claw attack. Follow it up with flamethrower. Follow it up with flamethrower on the skun tank. And an earthquake attack. Potential cool is going to be a dragon claw because of its water typing. Three Dragon Claws and down goes Tentacruel and that's us into the next round. And now we've got to fight Sophia. Who's got Pokemon at level 70. So we've still got a 10 level gap but Thunderbolt attack. Damn it Electro. Um, Pyrotechnics go. Go Honchkray. Drill Peck. Fly. Faint. Faint attack. Faint attack down goes the Pidgeot. Next is a Nido Queen. Set that out of a fly attack. Try a faint attack. Better bring you back up with a max potion. Drill pack attack. Down goes down goes Nido Queen. And she's closing out with a with a float so That would be perfect for a Pikachu if it wasn't unconscious at the moment. So I'm gonna bring him back. If we're gonna go straight into the next battle, if we're not gonna get a chance for um, a Pokemon Center heal up or recovery session. Then I need to get the Pokemon back on my feet my way. With max potions on all of my powerhouses. And if you're just going to keep using moves that are my own type, then I'm not going to go down to you.
We need a team. We need our team at full health for the next round. The next round is the level 80s, so. Let's finish it with Drill Pet now. Sophia went down. The winner is Johnny. The next round, we're at the halfway point. It's time for a battle between two powerful trainers. Johnny versus Pearl. Let's fight Pearl next. Pearl sending out her Sceptile. Pikachu's not the one for that, but Colditch definitely is. And her Pokemon are going to be at level 80, so anything from now on, we're going to be below. Any battles we have from now on, we're going to be below them after this battle, so... That's why I put a couple... I put Pikachu up to level 91. But hopefully we can get this done. Well, I mean, we're not doing too badly considering after this battle we're going to be below on all of our battles, so. If we can get Blizzard to hit from time to time, we can take Pearl out and then next we're going to be in for one hell of a battle. Because next I think you get one of your big major, right? You get a champion, I think. So she sent in her Lapani. Come on, Gold Itch. Come on, Gold Itch. Bloody hell, Gold Itch. Get out of there. Let Pyrotech come in and do this. We'll take out her Lapani with, fl with flame based attacks. Got Drift Blim, which should go down to the same type of move. Oh, it blew itself up anyway. And Electrike to finish it. Electrike goes down. There we go. We've beaten Pearl. And that puts us into the next battle. In the next round, we fight Gold. Johnny versus Gold. And Gold is going to have Pokemon at level 85. I'm going to switch to cold it's and hope for a blizzard to hit. Blizzard will take out Meganium. Typhlosion, I'm going to go I'm going to go for water pulse. All right, I'm going to go for a, I'm going to use a full restore now. I'm double weak to fire though, so I need something that's got water. So in comes Draconis next. We'll use Surf Attack. Because everything we fight, we're going to be a few levels below from now on. We've got two more rounds left. One at 90 and one at 100, I think. But he's got for Alligator. So Thunderbolt's definitely coming in on this one. We don't have Stab, though, because we're using it from our Dragonite. So if he can survive a Hydro Pump, which he can, one more Thunderbolt down, we'll go with that Pokemon. He's got an Umbreon next. Uh, it's this, now it's time for a full restore. And we're going to Outrage. Draconis can't escape, so whatever happens, Draconis has to either go down or win the battle. So I might as well go into Outrage and just try and slam slam dunk anything he sends out. And in comes Tyranitar. Go for an Ice Beam. Sandstorm finished him off. Uh... I think Pyrotech's the best option at this point. Go for Fire Blow. Bloody hell, Hydro Hyper Beam's gonna finish him. Let's get Pyrotechnic back on his feet. Pyrotech 
Pyro Tech's not going to be any use against um, this guy, but cold it's will. So we need to get cold it's back on his feet. And we could do with having Draconis back available for battle, you know. Even if Pyrotech has to go down in the has to go down as a sacrifice while we're doing this. We're sending Colditz next. He's got a waterfalls attack. Which will confuse Tyranitar. Lost give me a chance to go in for a Giga Drain attack on the rock type. We can survive an earthquake and we'll go in one more Giga Drain. And he's got Rotom! Rotom in the electric one, the electric version. So that one's going to be Jaws all over and a Jaws and an earthquake attack. Oh, Rotom's got Levitate. He can't get me with electric moves and I can't get him with ground, but I've still got Dragon Claw. I'll smash his substitute up with a drag with a Dragon Claw. He's going for double team trying to avoid me. But he's gone down from the sand attack. Gold's down. Every time I grow, you surpass me. You are amazing. Johnny advances to the next round. Major confrontation. The first battle of the semi-finals. Johnny versus Steven. Now this one could be a relatively easy one. Because Steven is a type-based trainer. He uses steel type. Which means a fire type like Pyrotech is going to be able to hopefully like one hit him a lot of the time. And that's what I'm banking on. I'm banking on Flamethrower and Fire Blow being able to one hit most of his Pokemon and then we're going to be in the final. And we all know who the champion is. As much as I disagree with him being the champion, because he's not a good enough trainer in my book. God, Earthquake's powerful. Okay, we need something that can stop Earthquake. Honchquake, go. Jaws, go. Because you've got the Earth, earth power as well. Because Bastiodon is a different matter when it comes to um, its moves. But Earthquake will take care of it. It's got a bronze on. I think I'm going to stick with Jaws for a bit. I need a sacrifice. Cold it's going, would you? Need a sacrifice for Pyrotech. Just for a moment. We're getting Jaws back on his feet as well. I'm very much competing with time here. So I'm going to send in Pyrotech. And pick up where we left off with fire attacks. Because it certainly will work, you know, eventually. Glass played over with a fire blow attack. He's psychic, oh, he's bite. Is 
finish off play doll. He's got a Metagross. Of course he's got a Metagross. He's Steven Sodding Stone. Fire Blow. And finishing with Lava Surf. Down goes the Metagross. And in comes Agron. His final Pokemon is an Agron. And Flamethrower should be able to handle it. Agron's down. We've beaten Stephen Stone. And we're into the final. And in the final, of course, it's Ash Ketchum. The final battle will be Johnny vs. Ash Ketchum. Johnny, I knew from the first time I saw you that you had great potential. You'd better battle with all your might. I'll defend the title of champion with everything I've got. So we're fighting Ash. Ash has got level 100 Pokemon. And I've got a very weak team anyway. Because we've just battled four battles in a row. But Fire Blow should be enough to wipe out his Venusaur. Bloody hell, his Venusaur could hang on from, from Lava Surf. But I suppose it is 20 levels above. Snorlax is going to be the perfect opportunity for me to get some healing done. I really have to. Because at the moment, we're pretty much screwed over at this point with our health and stuff. So Jaws take the sacrifice and go down. I'm going to call for Electro on this one. Because of how powerful my Pikachu is. I'm going to power for Focus Punch. Okay, Snorlax is just spamming Hydra, Hy Hyper Beam then. I need to take it out quickly then. I need to wipe out that Snorlax at speed, man. Go to Outrage again, Dragonite, and finish it off quickly. God, Dragonite went down. Pyrotechnic, finish it off with a, a Lava Surf. He's got a Blastoise. Electro's currently down, so Cold Itch, it's all yours. Get a revive on that Pikachu. Bloody, bloody stat. You're going to have to suck that Blastoise dry. Cold it. You're out of PP. Great. Um, Blizzard attack. It's going to have to be. If Charizard hits you with a move, you're done for. Get out of there. Haven't really got anybody else to send in, but go Honch Cray. Draconis, we need you for this battle. Surf. Oh, that nearly took his Charizard down. One more surf down goes Charizard. Yes! got his Blastoise back. He's still got three Pokemon to go. But you've got you've got Thunderbolt, haven't you, Draconis? And take out that Blastoise. He's got two left. And I know one of them is Pikachu. And the other one is this Espeon right here. So let's go for an Ice Beam. That Psychic's going to finish you. So, oh, Honchcrow would be perfect right now. So Pyrotechie on the next best option. Use Bite Attack. Pyrotech, hang on. I'm going to get Honchcray back up. Survive one more turn and I'll be able to full restore Honchcray. Honchcray can fight this next one. And then it's Pikachu then. So I know who I need to fight Pikachu. I need Jaws. I need Jaws as well.
I've got the two Pokemon I think I need to finish this. You can go down now, Pyrotech, and stay down. Go, Honchkray. Faint attack. It's going to keep using Morning Sun, but eventually you'll catch up to it. It'll run out of Morning Sun eventually, and you'll be able to finish it with Faint attack. Going for Psych Up. Drill Peck finishes Espeon. And now it's time for the final fight. It's Pikachu. Thunderbolt's going to take out Honchkray, I expect. By getting a faint attack. Pikachu's injured. Finish it, Jaws. Light screen all you want. Earthquake. Down goes Pikachu. We have won and won the World Championship. We beat Ash Ketchum. Incredible. Now you're the new world champion. You're the best trainer in the world. And we've woken up in bed. We are the world champion. Yeah, baby. Now, is there anything else we can do? Because now we've beaten Ash... I don't think there's anything else to do in this game. I think that might be it. But I'm going to take a pause for a second just to check. Because I don't want to end, end, end the video and then sort of confirm that, you know, nothing, whatever. But I'm, I'll, I'll be back in a second. Of course, guys, what we've got to do now is collect legendaries. Yeah. I'm very much looking forward to collecting legendaries, he says, whilst clearly lying. Well, we'll start that in the next episode. This episode ends, and I'll see you in the next one, where we're going to collect some legendary Pokemon. See you then.